Kirsty, congratulations. A very emotional performance up there from yourself. Must be delighted to turn that around and get the win to get into the semi finals this week. Do you know what it is, right? Up there, I felt really, really comfortable. Um, I practiced beforehand, I couldn't hit a thing. Uh, and I went up there and I just thought, come on. It's got to happen at some point. And there was not one moment in that game that I thought I was going to lose, even when I went one sit down. Uh, so, you know, to come back and come back how I did, I'll take that. Averages, no averages, whatever. I, I know I can battle with the best of them and I know I can bring it back. And that is what I did. And, you know, well done me. It's been a, a long old wait from the last 16 to the quarterfinals. Is that just a case of, do you think... The nerves are building over all those days and finally it comes to the day when you're when you're on the lakeside stage and playing in the quarterfinal. No, do you know what it is? I'll happily admit it and uh, the people that travel with me all year and the people that I play on the tour all year know I am very, very weak at finishing and that is my weakness. I'm a power scorer. I play a, I play a score. Um, I don't play to finish and I try, as much as I try and as much as I put time in on the board to finish it doesn't happen so if I can carry on power scoring like I know I can I'm going to have a lot of opportunity to finish and that is what I'll take in the next game and it's great to see how much it means to you up on that stage we saw some big celebrations particularly in the second and third sets is that just a case of letting the emotion out yeah, it is. Um, when you look at the draw, uh, we all know that the big seeds and uh, the big players are in the top end. Uh, us at the bottom, we're kind of just picking the competition up, uh, but we have the game to beat these big players. Um, so I would have been very, very disappointed if I'd have gone out at this stage. Um, next match, not so much. Uh, I think a lot more of... Uh, Rianne and, and Maria uh, I just wanted to get through today I know I can bring my game and play these two players uh, and hopefully you'll see me Sunday Maria obviously a, a semi-finalist on this stage Rianne's been in two finals give us a prediction who do you think you're going to be playing in that semi-final do you know what these two women have more experience than I do on stage um, I haven't played county for maybe five years I don't have stage experience unless I'm at the WDF uh, stage competitions um, as much as I think it'll be a close game, uh, I hope Maria comes out on top, but I'm a very, very big fan of Rianne too. So I hope that I hope the ladies have a good game and whoever wins is uh, is better on the day. Just a couple of games from being crowned a world champion now. Does it creep into the back of your mind that on Sunday you could be a world darts champion? Of course it is. I mean, um, if you weren't here to win the world title, if you weren't here to think about winning the world title... No point in being here. I get up on that stage. I know what I can produce, and I, I can play the averages of these players. Today it didn't happen. Uh, I'm gutted with that performance, but like you say, I'll uh, I'll pick myself up, and I'll be better tomorrow. Okay. Thank you very much for your time. Congratulations again, Kirsty. Thank you.